Hey y'all, it's Denise. It's Friday, March 20th, and uh, today's my daughter Amy's birthday, and uh, I just wanted to show y'all a few things I've been making for her, and I wanna do a VR for Tammy's stamping therapy. I'll show you what I made for her, and a few other uh, projects I've made for Happy Mail. That's what my main focus now is on Happy Mail. Uh, first, I wanted to uh, show you, I, these must have fallen out when uh, I was showing you Gina and Sheila's Happy Mail. And these are Sheila's gorgeous, gorgeous uh, rosettes. She used a dye, and I don't have a dye like that. That is so pretty. I just usually score it on a scoreboard and there's straight edges, but these, this is so much prettier. And the colors of this paper are just stunning. There's a little butterfly and roses and a little dragonfly over here. That's just so pretty. Thank you, Sheila. I just had to show everybody that because it's just stunning. So I want to make sure I told everybody about that. And then for uh, Tammy, for her uh, challenge, this is a VR. Uh, and shown you already this um, little vanity makeup case and it's velcro and it's got uh, there's some goodies in there and it's just got the little silver mirror card in there to look like a mirror and i just tried to make the projects maybe not all vintage vintage but kind of old you know things from the past this is my theme it doesn't the paper doesn't all match but i was trying to just you know use some uh, uh something that projects that are older so there's that that she's getting and then this uh, purse that I love it's got it holds uh, a two size cards that y'all it's so easy to make it's just very easy to make and it always comes out pretty so I've just put uh, a couple of uh, a two size cards in there and uh, there's a little pocket here you could put some die cuts or something like that inside and I made um, the tassels out of this matching pink peachy color and then this designer paper right here I made two tassels and a little tag over here it just says thinking of you and then I think one of the one of the requirements was uh, a, a, a card and just a greeting card and a crafter's choice and a memory decks card so I made this card and it just says congratulations and stamped on the inside. Let's celebrate you. And I stamped the envelope, a little flower. And then the other one's very similar. But I embossed this. And uh, this one says, always remember, life is better with a friend like you. So I thought those were pretty. I hope she likes it. They're simple, but I still think they're very nice. I'm not the greatest at card making. I'm still working on that. And then it just closes like this with the Velcro. Very easy. There's the back. I put a lot of bling on there. And of course, some of Sheila's trim that I put on everything. And uh, this, y'all, I was so proud of this. Now, it's just an ordinary little box, but it's reinforced. And for the first time ever, I came up with my own dimensions to make this. This is the first time I've ever been able to do that. So I had uh, this bar of soap, and it's, it's a heavy bar of soap that I wanted to put in a box. And I wanted it reinforced meaning the sides are folded over. It's just not one single sheet of card there because it warps. And then I made the lid, and for the first time ever, it's a nice snug fit, and it works. So there you go. I was super proud of that. Just made a little bow on top and little tags as friend. And then for Tammy, uh, I made a Rubik's Cube box. I mean, it looks like a Rubik's Cube. Decorated the bottom. And I think these are pretty much the colors that's on a, re a regular uh, Rubik's Cube. And it just opens up like this. And there's some little goodies in there for her. Very simple to make, too. And it just closes like that. And I thought that was just adorable. I love it. My son liked that. He said, oh, can you make me one of those? I said, yeah, sure. I'll make you one. 
And then uh, I have some happy mail that I want to do. I've been making that because I've got a lot going out. And this is a box I made that holds note cards. And I put some mirror card on there. I love that stuff. I ordered it from Amazon, so I'm waiting for that to come in. And this just holds little note cards. And these are thank you cards I made. Different. They're all a little bit different. I stamped the envelope. And it just says... Thank you. And it just says, just because. They're all a little bit different. Let's see. That one I wasn't real crazy about. I think I overdid it with the glitter down here, the little sequin thing. But it just says, thank you very much. I'm not the greatest at card making, y'all. I'm still working on that. And then, thank you again. There's my pretty mirror card I love. I can't live without that. And it just says, sending you sunshine. I've got more coming. I'll be so glad when it gets here. And some acetate. I'm all out of acetate. And there's the you know, envelope. And this one. Again, they're all thank you cards. You're, you you brighten up my day, it says on the inside. I put a little ribbon bow on there. So they're, they're all just, they're all basically like that. And um, it's, uh, it's got, I put layers of card on here. It's not folded over like I like, but with a 12 by 12, unless you join the paper, this is about a, as big a size of box as you can get that the paper, the sides are actually folded over, which is what I like. Unless you can use chipboard, then you can make any size you want. But uh, there, that was Happy Mail. And then uh, also for Happy Mail, I've made some tags. I still have, I got charms on each one of them. They're all a little bit different. There's a little high heel shoe there. And I still got to put the to and the from on the back, but it's just basically flowers and butterflies. And you can just take a simple bag and just just dress it up with tags. They're all a little bit different. They all have a little different charm on there. That one. I just love these butterflies and flowers. There's a little star and little sequins. Again, my mirror card and I can't live without. There's another little, there's a flamingo up here. I just love these butterflies. I can't wait for my Amazon order to come in. I got my art glitter glue, but that's about it. And I have several things I wanted. But these tags. Yeah, you could just take a simple, a plain bag and put this on there and dress it up. So I don't know who it's going to yet, but I'm getting ready to send out a bunch of happy mail. And then for uh, Amy... I made her card, and I put her name using Gina's stickers, Amy, and then put 36 up here. And uh, this was a Stampin' Up! stamp, and I die cut the happy birthday. And I haven't done anything on the inside yet. I'll do that tomorrow. I'll be tired tomorrow, y'all. And then uh, it's uh, custom in our house on somebody's birthday. However old they are, that's how much money they get. So I made this little wallet, like a little wallet style, and it's got a Velcro opening. You just open it up, and uh, here's your little pocket right here to put your money in. So she's going to like that. And uh, that's a Stampin' Up! stamp set, wishing you every happiness this special day will bring. And it just says, Happy Birthday, and I colored the little uh, ladybugs. It just closes up like that. This is so simple to make, y'all. I mean, you can make it in no time. I love this. And uh, this purse. Now, Amy wanted it. I if, it. if I'd known she'd wanted it, I would have put happy birthday on there. But she liked it. So I said, okay, if you want it, you can have it. And it's so big, I can barely show it to you. But I've got little eyelets on the pocket. This is a pocket. And just to decorate it up a little bit. And I don't know what I'm going to put in there yet, but there's the pocket. Big, nice size pocket. But I want to put some, uh, a tag or some tassels or something on it. And inside so far, all I have is the uh, uh, stuffed envelope. And I'll fill it up for her. I've got gift cards for her. 
And uh, there's the back. I just put some paper back there. And then I showed you that. That's also more happy mail. And there's my memory decks cards. I showed you all that. And what else was there? It was one more thing. Now, oh, this. I came across a channel. Let's see. Who was it? It was Christy R. Crafts. Now, this is for, like, a little girl. But I thought it was kind of cute. If, like, for a wand or something like that. It's just tool that's filled with sequins. And there's little stars and... I think there's a couple little butterflies in there. And I just put some eyelash trim around the center of it. And I mean, it, it's for a little girl, definitely. But I thought that on a wand, that would be really cute. So I kind of liked it. And I liked her channel. There was all kind of cute little, cute little projects. And uh, let's see, what else was there? There was, I think there was one more thing I wanted to show you, but I can't think right now. I'm tired, y'all. Um, I think that's it. So I'll film everything. I'll finish everything up tomorrow and show you uh, how everything's decorated. I'll probably sleep till noon at least and then uh, get up. I've got a cake to bake and uh, decorations to put up. But it's a great day. My daughter's turning 36. I can't believe it. I'm an old lady now. But y'all have a great day. Oh, one more thing before I forget. I want to thank Tammy from... Uh, Let's see, Tammy, I always get your channel mixed up. It is Tammy's Creative Cards and Crafts. Uh, I asked her to uh, do a shout-out for Suzanne Doko after uh, seeing Suzanne's uh, last, um, uh, where she showed some of her projects because they are just gorgeous. And, of course, Tammy did it. She watched the video, and she wrote me back, and she said, Oh, my goodness, she is talented. And I said, Yes, she is. So I just want to thank Tammy for uh, giving Suzanne a shout out. And y'all, go check her out. This lady is so talented and we will learn so much from her. And Carmen also, she gave her a shout out because she is on another level. I'll tell you right now. And I really appreciate Tammy and Carmen doing that because Suzanne's a dear friend. And um, I just wanted to, you know, just tell y'all please go over there and check out her channel. You will not be disappointed at all. And I think that's about it. I showed, uh, she, yeah, that was about it. That's all I've been doing. Well, it's it's plenty. I've been uh, working all day long. Uh, actually, I had made two or three different other projects, but they did not come out, and I could not send them to Tammy, so in the trash they went, which was a shame because I put a lot of time into it, but uh, that's okay. I'm learning. I'm learning. And I, I just can't send out something that I'm not happy with. So y'all have a great day. And uh, I'll show you pictures of everything decorated. And I'll be back soon. So bye-bye. Y'all have a great day. Great weekend. Bye-bye. And y'all stay safe.